Objectives Number 1. To discuss the formula of future value and present value. Number 2. To find the difference on how to solve future value and present value. Future value Future value is the value of the current asset at a future date based on assumed rate of growth. The future value is important to investors and financial planners as they use it to estimate how much investment made today will be worth in the future. Formula of future value Future value is the same as future worth. FB is equals to present value 1 plus interest rate raised in number of years. Where FB is the future value, PB is the present worth, I is for the interest, and N is for the number of years. Present value Present value is the current value of future sum of money or stream or cash flow at specified rate of return. Future cash flows are discounted at the discounted rate. And the higher the discounted rate, the lower the present value of the future cash flows. So PB is equals to FB 1 plus I raised to the number of years. Or, PB is equals to FB divided by 1 raised to I, or 1 plus I raised to N. Where PB is equals to present value, FB is the future value, I for the discount rate for interest, and N number of periods for years. Interest and rate Interest Interest is the charge of the privilege of borrowing money, typically expressed as annual percentage rate, or APR. Interest can be referred to the amount of ownership a stockholder has in a company, usually expressed as percentage. Rate Rate is a special ratio in which two terms are in different units. Types of years in payment Compounded annually means one year. Compounded semi-annually means twice a year, which is 10 times 2. Compounded quarterly means every 4 months, so 10 times 4. Compounded monthly means every month, so n times 12. So these are the number of years. Anna plans to buy an earrings worth of 35,000 pesos at 6% compounded annually for 12 years. Find the future value after she finished paying it. So first step that you have formula, it will be future value is equals to present value 1 plus interest rate raised to the number of years. So first, is a substitute natin yung present value na worth of 35,000. So 1 plus 0 0.06, which is 6%, pinalitan natin ng decimal. Ang n natin is 12 years. So pag in natin yung 1 plus 0 0.06 at raised to 12, lalabas siya ng 2.012196. Then multiply uli natin siya sa 35,000. So, ang future value niya ay 70,426.877 pesos. Helen plans to buy a 60 square meter lot in Palmera subdivision worth of 1,330,000 pesos at 8% compounded semi-annually for 10 years. Find the future value. So, formula for future value will be present value. 1 plus i as an interest raise the number of years. So first is a substitute natin lahat ng mga value. So future value, ang present value niya ay 1,330,000 plus 1 plus 0.06 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 plus 0.06
So, lumabas ang kanyang babayaran for 10 years ay 2,848,460 points. Number 3, 51,000 pesos at 8.5% compounded quarterly for 8 years. Find a future bond. So, the formula for the future bond is equal to press bond 1 plus i as an interest times raised to the number of years. So, at first, is a substitute natin yung future bond which is 51,000 plus 1 8.5%. So, papalitan natin siya ng 0 0.085 divided by 4. Kasi quarter So, yung 8 times 4, magmumultiply din ulit pa rin. So, 8 times 4 will be 32. And then, 0 0.085 divided by 4, 0 0.02125. So, lalabas ay 1.02125 raised to 32. So, pag ni-raise natin siya at i-multiply natin siya sa 51,000, lalabas ang future value nito ay 99,853.30 pesos. Find the present value. 43,000. So, isa-substitute natin yung value ng mga future value 1 plus i raised to the negative. So, ang future value niya ay 43,000. So, 1 plus 0.10 which is 10% and then raised to the negative 5 as a 5 years. So, ang future value niya inad natin yung 1 plus 0.10 1 0.10 raised to the negative 5 so, 1.10 raised to the negative 5. Lalabas siya ng 0 0.620. At kumumultiply natin sa 43,000. So, lumalabas ang present value. 26,699.6. Number 5. raised to the negative end. So, ang first step na gagawin natin is substitute lahat natin yung mga given. Ang future value niya ay 128,423.40 pesos. So, ang interest, interest rate niya ay 6%. Palibasa, compounded sa amin annually, kaya i-divide sa 2. So, yung 6%, pinilitan natin ng 0 0.06 divided by 2 plus 1 and then, itinimes din natin siya sa number of years. So, 8, negative 8 times 2. So, 1.03 and then raised to the negative 16. At inad natin yung 1.03, lalabas siya ng 1.03 raised to the negative 16. At minultiply natin siya sa 128,423.40 
lalabas ang present value ay 128,423, 140. I-multiply natin siya sa 0.62317. So, ang total ng present value niya ay 80,000. 0.29.22